welcome back to my channel. My name is Diana and today I have an awesome Shein haul of House of CB dresses. If you saw my previous video, I have not had any good luck with actual House of CB dresses because they don't fit. <laughs> they ran small or the bust was way too big for the size of the rest of the dress so none of them fit me or flattering. They were really impossible to put on. So I found a bunch of dupes and House of CB inspired dresses from Shein, which I'm sharing today. I've also included some great evening wear dresses and dresses that are gonna be killer for New Year's Eve. So let's get going. If you wanna see what I am doing on the daily and how I'm styling all of my outfits and all of my items, remember to follow me on Instagram right here. I actually can't remember the name of this House of CB dress that it is modeled after, but I did buy it in my last video and yeah, it didn't fit well. So this actually is a pretty nice dupe. It has, uh, let me see, it has this like a little skirt part where it's um, attached to the skirt. So it's kind of fitted at the hip and has this flare up part on the skirt. It's not see-through when I tried it on. And what's really cool about this dress, it has real cups and there's like foam padding in here, right here. And then it has, like uh, actual wire, underwire cup right here. There's no boning, but it has the underwire cup if you need the support. And they do also, just like the House of the CB version, they have this like nice little trim detail right here, which is really, really pretty. And then the straps are adjustable right here. If you look right here, yep, adjustable. And it is a back zip dress. It fit pretty well. The cups were just slightly big and it is slightly loose around the waist for me, but otherwise this is a pretty good House of CB inspired dress. It does also have pockets, which is pretty good. So I would say overall, this is a pretty good dress that looks very similar to the House of CB one. The, obviously the fabric is a lot thinner and it is not um, lined. There's no skirt lining, but it's not see-through. I believe the top, yep, the top is lined though, however. Wait, actually part of the skirt, sorry. Part of the skirt is lined. It has just partial lining, so it doesn't go all the way down. And this partial lining looks like a, fat, a polyester material. Next up is this little white dress. I don't. I also don't remember what the name of this uh, on House of CB is, but um, it is a cute little white dress. The material is really nice on this one. It is double lined, so it has the lining on the bottom. I mean, on the inside throughout the whole dress because it's a short dress. And the actual material here is really nice. It's like a thick, stretchy satin. So it's very, very stretchy. Uh, the straps are also adjustable, just like the House of CB. And it does have this nice little bow. It looks really, really, almost exactly like the House of CB dress. It has cups, but it doesn't have the um, padding or anything on the cups or any kind of wire or any boning in this dress. It is very fitted, however, because uh, this material is very stretchy. It looks really good on a fit me perfectly. I would say this is like a really good dupe of the House of CB dress. I also like that this lace that they have here over the cups. It really looks just like it. It's a really good dupe. The length is just about past mid thigh on me. So for a short, short girlies, this is actually a pretty good length. It's got that kind of a lingerie style to it. I have had my eye on this little dress uh, for a while now. It comes in so many different colors. The fabric on this is absolutely gorgeous. Again, it's like a thick, thick satin that's a super stretchy and super shiny. It is lined, it is double lined, so that's nice, but this is not gonna be see-through at all, and it's lined all the way through. It has a boning, it has real boning, so it has two bones, oh, actually, yeah. Wait, four. So it has two two here and two here. So like two on each side. So total four bones. It has this lovely scoop neckline, which is really beautiful. And this kind of ruching on the side, which is super, super flattering when it's on. And it's a back zip. It's a short dress. I think it fits about, it's just a little bit below mid thigh for me. So it's not super short. It also has this like uh, silicone lining right here to help it stay up. I gotta say, the waist on this one was a perfect fit for me. It really snatched in my waist, but the chest part was a little bit big for me. I did try this on without a bra, but I think with a bra, it would be a really nice, like a, you know, like a padded bra or like a push-up bra. It would fit really, really nicely. This is definitely a cute dress and it'll be great for New Year's Eve or just going out and partying. 
If you want a super spicy, super hot, super sexy dress for New Year's Eve, this is it. It is a super short and it has a super large slit on the side that basically shows your hip like all the way up to your hip. You need like some really high-waisted underwear so that it doesn't show. But this dress is a super duper sexy. It um, has two ties in the back to hold it together so that it doesn't fall forward. But it's got straps right here. The straps are not adjustable. I found the straps to be a little bit short for me, but that could be just the way I tied it. But yeah, you tie it back. This material again is double line. It's two layers of fabric and it is like, this one is so stretchy. It's like, super duper stretchy and super form fitting. The skirt is really short. So if you are short, this might be a great dress for you. If you are tall, it might not work for you because the slit is so high. It literally comes up to my like hip right here, like about mid hip for me. So yeah, if you are looking for a sexy dress, this is it. You know, red is literally the color of a fall and winter this year. So you might wanna pick this up for a New Year's Eve. Totally have mixed feelings about this dress. This is not a House of CB Duke, but I can't remember why I've seen this before. It's that um, it's got the flower applique right in the bust area and up the, up the straps, but the back strap doesn't have it and it is adjustable straps. This is a long uh, maxi dress. The material is a little bit thin. It's not double lined like some of the other dresses and it is a stretch. Oh, it's just very slightly stretchy. It's not really all that stretchy, <laughs> but it does have the cup detail, but there's no underwire in the cups or any kind of boning. I really, really like the way this dress fits on me for a small bust. Um, the cups are very flattering and they do fit, but the only problem I have is this detail right here. I feel like the flowers just kind of cut off and there's like no good continuity. Yeah, they just kind of cut off. So I'm not really sure I love this part, but otherwise I love everything about this dress. I think I may have seen this on Princess Polly or something. Maybe they have a better version, but yeah, this is the only part that bothers me. I might still keep it though because it is really pretty and it fits really well. And I don't think there's a slit, no, there's no slit. I was um, looking for a long maxi dress or a long black satin maxi skirt. So this could be it if you just put a sweater over it. Overall, I really like this dress. I'm just not sure about these flowers right here. Next up is this gorgeous uh, two-piece set that's a crop top and a maxi skirt. I picked this up in black and it is a simply stunning. This set is so good. The material is super, super thick and stretchy. It's like a satiny material and yeah, it's, it's just really thick. It's not double line or anything, but the material itself is just really, really thick and beautiful. The skirt is super pretty. It has kind of like a, a little bit of a mermaid shape, so it flares out at the bottom. The length of it is perfect for me. It hits me like right below the ankle, so you can still see my feet. Um, the top is cropped and it's got like kind of a loose fit on top and it has a high neckline and these two buttons in the back that clip together to close it off. I would say this runs a slightly small. I think I got the smallest size and I think I could have gone up one size to make it a little bit looser, a little bit more like, I feel like the top is a little bit tight on me. So I feel like it would have been cuter. It was just a little bit looser, but I highly recommend this. This will be so pretty for NYE if you want to not wear a dress and maybe just do a two piece set. And it'll be gorgeous for any any kind of event or formal event you have coming up. So cute, highly recommend. This little white dress might be my favorite House of CB Duke from this entire haul. It fits so well. It's a corset front, as you can see, it's a hook and eye closure all the way down. It has a super deep V kind of front like the dress I'm wearing, but it goes deeper. The back is actually a lot longer than the front. It like really fluffs out. It's just so cute. It's definitely a, a hundred out of a hundred on this one. It has cups, but there is no boning in this dress. This dress has no boning. The cups are so small bust friendly. It also has this like the silicone again to kind of help you stay up. This dress snatches you in and makes you look so good like no other. The bust is so flattering on a small chest. It has elastic around the back to better fit. I actually, didn't think it was gonna fit me because this material is not stretchy at all, but it does and it just cinches in my waist so beautifully. It is 
super duper short. It's like really, really short. I think I might have picked up the petite version. I'll double check and I'll list it down below, but there is a longer version, I believe. But this is so cottage core, so princess core vibes. It's just, I can just imagine running through a meadow in this dress because the side just like puffs out so much like those House of CB dresses you see on Instagram and on Pinterest. 100% on this dress. I love it. I did end up picking a House of ZB Carmen dupe. I actually picked up several and none of them were good. They all kind of sucked and they were terrible. The fit was bad. Just overall, the quality was terrible. But this one is really good because it has those same adjustable straps, just like the House of CB Carmen. The back has the, what is it, the cinching. This is, it's the, uh, yeah, the corset back with the string and the cinching. It really does cinch you in and it does have boning. Oh my God. It has like so much boning or not so much. I would say, <laughs> sorry. It has the two bones right here in the front to help hold up the dress. It is a side zip up here and it is lined, but it's only partially lined because this is white. It is a little bit see-through and you can kind of see the lining. But the lining is sewn in, so it won't really shift around. Also, the bust is a little bit big on this one, and it's not adjustable. So, like, the string is fixed right here. You can't make it smaller. So, yeah, the bust is a little bit big on this one, but definitely not as big as the real Carmen, where it just, if you saw my other video, it was just, like, stuck out like this. It's not quite that, that exaggerated and that big. Overall, this is maybe, like, a 6 to 7 out of 10. Um for a dress that fits like the Carmen. But you know, the Carmen I think was kind of a terrible dress anyway. And I gave that dress like a zero out of 10. So this isn't bad. If you have the type of body that fits the Carmen, the House of CB Heart Carmen, you know, like big boobs, tiny, tiny waist, you know, that Barbie doll figure, I suggest you get the House of CB real dress. It will look amazing on you. But if you are, you know, more, smaller busted this might fit you better but yeah the bust does still run a little bit big but i do love the corset feature where it kind of cinches you in this is another gorgeous house of cb dupe this is such a beautiful dress this is literally a floor length gown it comes in a bunch of different colors but i picked this up in this beautiful emerald green because i thought it would look good on me what do you think <laughs> It has so much fabric. It is a very, very, very stretchy. It's, I think, kind of almost like a swimsuit material. It has a nice little slit up the side and has, I think, this is called a horse hair to kind of like hold out the hem of the dress. It is very, very, very long. Even with my highest heels, this dress is too long on me. But I think that's the intent. I think it's supposed to kind of like, you know, drag on the floor like you have a train. I'm not 100% sure. It is a bone. It's got like so much bone. It's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten bones. So like five on each side. So the front is well bone and it's got bones on the side. And it is a back zip. And it has these two like shoulder straps that kind of just hang off, like off the shoulder sleeves almost. This dress is gorgeous. <clears throat> it is very fitted. It has that kind of like called a mermaid dress basically it's fitted at the hips and flares out on the bottom unfortunately though it does run kind of big yeah on me it was just a little bit loose overall in the bodice if you are a little bit bigger than me this would look so amazing on you because you know it's just a little bit loose i wish they had made it just slightly smaller it would have been perfect but it is such a gorgeous dress great dupe for house of cb great dress for new year's eve so pretty if you're going somewhere fancy and you don't want to spend a lot of money on a evening dress this is going to be a great dress for you i actually have two more carmen dress dupes these are not from uh shein these are actually from i believe uh i got them over summer they're from aliexpress and these both fit really really well i think um so one of them this blue one does not have any boning but the cups fit really well and they fit just perfectly. They also have the string and the corset back to make it cinch in. It is a side zip. But yeah, the strings are not fixed. You can actually push these in more, which makes it a really good fit. But the straps are fixed and I found the straps just slightly short on me. 
but it does have that nice V in the front. But again, there's no boning. These these uh, the boning here is just you know a strip of fabric to make it look like there's boning, but there's no actual boning. There is a nice slit. It's about a midi length, and I love the blueprint. It's actually a pretty good fit. I just wish the straps were a little bit longer. I also bought this dress because I saw it on TikTok. Um, somebody posted about this dress uh, being a good house of CB dupe. And this one does have boning. It actually has boning, two bones just in the front. Again, corset back. And the straps on this one are adjustable. They look just like the ones from Shein. Also a side zip as well. And the But the strings in the front are not adjustable. Overall though, the, I didn't... I wasn't sure I really loved how this fit across. It's more of a straight cut versus like a kind of cup cut, which is what I like about the blue one. This one, the cup is shaped a lot better. It has more of like a, I don't know what it, how you call it. It's more of like a U shape, whereas this is just kind of straight across and with a strap coming out, which is not as flattering, but I do like the, the bony. Uh, I did go up a size in this and I really shouldn't have. I should have gotten the extra small. I think I got this in a small. But overall, it is not bad. It's a decent dress and it is lined on the inside. Let me see if it's lined all the way through. No, it's also halfway lined, but it's not see-through at all. And this one, the blue one is also not lined. I can't tell. No, the blue one is not lined. So these are actually pretty good. Not bad. I think these are better. These might be better than the uh, House of CB Carmen dress dupes from Shein. That is it for today. I hope you liked this haul video and you liked all of the dresses I've shown today. Definitely remember to shop the links down below. I've linked everything with sizing information as well as my size information down below. And remember to follow me on Instagram right here if you want to see what I'm up to on the daily. If you like this video, you might also like this video on Shein dresses. These are my favorite dresses from Shein. And remember to like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.